All right, ladies, so how do you know if he is falling in love with you? How do you know if he's developing strong feelings of devotion, admiration, and commitment? Maybe you've been seeing this guy for a few months or a year, and you see that he likes you, but you want to know if it goes deeper than that. So I'm going to give you five signs that I've experienced myself and I've seen in my coaching practice that he's developing genuine love for you. Okay, so let's go down the list. And number one sign he's falling in love with you is he lives for your smile. Somebody asked me the other day and a live on Instagram, what is the first thing that you notice in a woman physically? And I instantly said her smile. Like I knew this, like whenever I see a woman that I'm attracted to, the first trait that catches my eye is always her smile. And I can tell you that when a man is falling in love with you, he gets so much satisfaction from just sparking positive feelings in you, like making you laugh, right? It's like the analogy that I always use. Imagine that a man is a car you know, driving with purpose and direction and a woman's joy is literally his gasoline, you know, the highest quality gas that gives him the energy to propel forward at an unstoppable speed. Like the moments that I've been in love in the past, I felt like a clown, you know, many times just, you know, cracking jokes and because I loved making my woman smile and it just brings this warm feeling knowing that she was happy by my side. And yes, some guys are a bit drier, you know, than others and don't have, let's say, much charisma but if he's falling for you I can tell you that the desire to make you smile is inside him and he may show it in other ways like you know sitting down with you to watch Grey's Anatomy which I find personally painful but I've done it in the past right to please some of the women that I was with and also I could see that they were happy so that also made me happy sign number two is he asks you meaningful questions when a man is falling for you, he's going to want to get to know you better, right? He will ask meaningful questions about your childhood, your fears and goals, and as a way to deepen your emotional connection. If he's already thinking about a future together, he wants to know your values and beliefs. He wants to build trust and intimacy. If he barely shows interest in what you have to say, doesn't care much about inquiring into who you are as a person, this may mean that you are in a one-sided relationship and he's there to extract from you and satisfy his needs. If you want to learn more about this, go check my other videos like the one that is titled uh, What Men Want in Women and Relationships. Number three is he starts being protective of you. He starts caring a lot about your emotional and physical safety. He wants to hear from you every day. Make sure that everything is going okay in your life. You know, as men, we find purpose in being the protector and basically your superhero. Think about all those superhero movies like Batman or Superman, you know, where these guys are basically untouchable, right? Nobody can hurt them. And then what happens? He starts falling for a girl and now the enemy realizes that this is the only way to hurt the guy. And there's so much truth to that, right? I can tell you that the first time that I felt this feeling in my life, I was on a plane and there was a lot of turbulence and the plane, you know, started dropping altitude like crazy and the people were screaming and shouting. I mean, the level of adrenaline and fear was insanely high. And my ex at the time, she was sitting next to me and all I could think about, okay, was her safety. Like, I remember looking at the exit door and thinking, okay, you know, if we crash, I'm going to grab her and just swim to the door and then push her out so she can live. And this was just an ex-girlfriend, right? Like, we didn't have any kids or anything. But I felt that deep instinct that if this goes down, my duty as a man is to make sure that the woman I love makes it out alive. And it's funny, like, sometimes I'm coaching a client and they say, you know, oh, he loves me but he doesn't speak to me you know he hasn't spoken to me in three days and I'm like what trust me if he was truly in love not a single day can go by without you hearing from him because your safety and well-being is a priority in his life unless you're in like a silly fight and both of you are waiting to see who calls first right but I hope that you're mature enough to avoid those childish games Sign number four he's falling in love with you is he wants to get to know your family better. 
maybe you don't have the best family or maybe you have an amazing family whatever the case is he's curious to know where you come from who are your parents your siblings you know how's your relationship with them he wants to spend time getting to know them you know because most relationships that I've had, I always remember, I, I always became best friends with my mother-in-law. You know, I was like a son to her. And if your man is falling for you, he will enjoy hearing stories of, like, you know, when you were a kid or embarrassing things that you did in high school. And in the same way, he wants you to get to know his family too, right? He wants to spend the holidays together, etc. All that as a way to deepen the connection between you two. And final number five is he values your opinion especially for important matters. One of the key aspects of him falling for you is that he will start developing deep admiration for you. But don't confuse this with your title or achievements, right? You can be the most renowned doctor in town and still he may not care about your opinion if he doesn't look up to you as a woman of integrity and dedication on the other hand you can be a housemaid and he may think you're the greatest human being that has walked this earth because of the way that you look after him you know how kind you are to other people so it always depends on the other person and what they value therefore if he praises your character he will want to know your thoughts on important issues because he trusts your instincts and point of view Anyways, those are the five signs I wanted to touch on. There's obviously, you know, many more, but I think these are a great starting points. And I hope that you found this video insightful and that you keep reading and learning about relationships, dating and human behavior. Because like I always say, for your relationships to change, you need to change. Have a beautiful day.